My name is Allie Tessitore and I am so pumped up that you are watching this video because it means that you want to hear more about the coach opportunity, more so about the imperfectly balanced coach sisterhood, which makes me even more excited because I love welcoming new women onto our team who are crazy about health and fitness, who want to change their lives and who are ready to help other people. So a little bit about me, I am a wife, a mom, a registered nurse, a certified holistic health coach, and a beach body coach. I married my middle school sweetheart, and we have three amazing, beautiful children, amazing, beautiful children, and we have two French bulldogs, and we have lots of fish. Our family just keeps growing. It's kind of crazy. I am a pediatric registered nurse who is not working in the hospital anymore. I am blessed to be able to work from home as a health coach. I am also a certified holistic health coach, and I've merged everything with Beachbody Coaching, and I am blessed, and I am humbled, and I am so grateful for this opportunity and to be able to share it with you. My health journey started back in June of 2012. It was six weeks postpartum of our third child. Uh, that is when my health and fitness journey started, it began, and it started all at the same exact time. I was the unhealthy strong girl up until June of 2012. I was skinny, uh, I was unhealthy, I had lots of stress, I had lots of anxiety, I had high blood pressure, I had TMJ, dealt with migraine headaches. I was unhealthy, but I looked fit because I was skinny. So it was six weeks postpartum after our third child. We had three kids under the five, three kids under the age of five. I was in grad school to be a nurse practitioner. My husband traveled every week for work. I was breastfeeding. I was not sleeping. I was a mess. I was a complete mess. And I was trying to maintain that perfection role. I was trying to be the type A personality who does everything, who has to do it all, has to do it all, super woman, super mom, best wife, best mom, best friend, best nurse. I had to be the best at everything and it all caught up to me and my life was simply unsustainable and it was at that six weeks postpartum that my health and my life kind of gave out, gave out on me. I was completely broken completely broken into pieces. I was suffering from severe TMJ where my jaw would lock. I was suffering from debilitating migraines that ended me up in the hospital at least once a month because I was afraid that I had a tumor, I had cancer, something was wrong with me. And worst of the worst, I was having severe debilitating panic attacks that completely took me out. Uh, for that summer that I started struggling with those, I was unable to drive my vehicle. I was unable to drive my car with my kids. I had to have someone help me drive them until I was able to stabilize my panic attacks. I had to be put on Xanax every three hours, every three hours around the clock until my body was able to reset and to come down from that place of panic that I was in. Uh, it was a lot, it was a lot. I had to drop out of grad school. I was unable to finish grad school. I had, it was just too much for me. I am an extrovert social butterfly and I completely became a hermit crab. I withdrew from everyone. I was afraid. I was judged. I felt I had such a loss of control and I was so embarrassed by it that I just shut down. I was on around the clock medication. I was taking daily medication. I was just trying to survive. I was not thriving. I was trying to survive life and I was not a good mom. I was not a good wife. I was not a good friend. I was not a good daughter. I was just living life. I was just a robot trying to overcome this obstacle in my life that completely debilitated me, completely debilitated. I don't know if any of you have ever been there before, something like this, your health, something catastrophic in life has taken over. You feel completely lost. You feel helpless, you feel hopeless, and you feel like you don't know if you're gonna live another day. And that is how I felt. I feared that my kids wouldn't have a mom. I feared that my husband wouldn't have a wife. I feared that I would not survive that dark, deep, scary place in my life. I didn't. I began counseling. My mom is an amazing therapist and I started seeing a, peers, a peer of hers. I started going to counseling. I started focusing on being still and calming my mind and really trying to become regrounded in who I was and who I was called to be. The woman that I was called to be as a woman, a wife, and as a mom, as a friend. And I realized that things in my life had to change. And I realized that I had to take my health back. I had to take my life back. So that is when I started implementing fitness and nutrition and exercise and 
learning to unplug and get off the hamster wheel of life and stop being controlled by my to-do list every day, I started to rebuild who I was from the inside out. I stopped being perfect. I stopped trying to do it all. I just started to focus on me and take my health back so that I could be the best wife to my husband and the best mom to my three children. When I started to do that, I realized, I realized that there were other women. There were other women that felt like me, but I was still too afraid to share. I was still too afraid to share my story. So I just kept working on me. During that time, like I said, I dropped out of grad school. I started to recover myself. And over the course of six months, I was able to completely get off of all medication. I was able to be free and clear of panic attacks. And it's been since January 9th of 2013 that I've been free of medication and free of panic attacks because I took my health back in my own hands and I, and I changed my life and I changed my health. I changed my family's life. Through that, I had a deep, deep desire, a deep love, a deep mission to pay it forward, to find other women, to help other women find their balance in getting healthy just like I did. Because I knew that if I struggled with that, I knew that if I struggled with anxiety and fear and panic, loss of control, judgment, I was judged by so many of my friends, that if I felt that way, if I felt lonely, if I felt disconnected, if I had a loss of identity, I knew that other women felt the same exact way. And I knew I wanted to help them overcome it. So it was in January of 2013 that I started, started my search. I started to find my purpose, my calling in life. Have you ever been there before? Have you ever wondered, what is my calling in life? What is my purpose? I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Well, that's when I began my search. So I started working out at the local park with some moms, just making workouts up, making meal plans, meeting them just for community. I started realizing I needed something more. I needed community. I needed friendship. I needed other women who were like-minded like me, who loved health and fitness, who wanted to change their life, who wanted to live a life, live a life of purpose. I needed women like that in my life. So I started to create that community. I started to lead the workouts for free and I eventually became a certified holistic health coach. But I realized I needed more. How was I gonna share my mission of what it meant to become imperfectly balanced, what it meant to live a life of balance and joy and peace and hope and health? How could I do that? So I kept looking. So for almost a year, I was presented with this incredible opportunity to become a Beachbody coach, but I kept saying no. Honestly, I didn't want to be labeled as an MLM. I didn't want to be salesy, but I wanted something more. So yes, it took me a year. It took me a year of searching and looking, but I finally said yes. I said yes to Beachbody coaching right before my 30th birthday, and I knew I was going to go all in. And let me tell you this. My life has been forever changed since I said yes to coaching, and I wish I would have said yes to coaching way sooner than a year. Because my life, my family's life, my community, hundreds of women's, of li women's lives have been forever changed because of coaching. It is our imperfectly balanced, balanced coach sisterhood. It is our mission. It is our mission now to be a beacon of hope and strength to other women, that they too can find their balance in getting healthy truly from the inside out, body, mind, and spirit. That we have a voice, that you have a voice, that you have a story. Yes, you, you have a story of hope and strength. You have a story of your imperfections that will inspire others. Your weaknesses are your strength and it's your story that is the platform to help other women. So coaching, coaching changed my life. It has changed my life. I lead every day from the front to spread the word, to spread the mission, to share my vision, my vision of health, hope, and community. Because that is what our team is about. In Perfectly Balanced Coaches, we are about sisterhood. We are about living life together. We are moms. We are stay-at-home moms. We are corporate America. We are corporate America moms. We are lawyers. We are physician's assistants. We are certified nurse anesthetists. We are therapists. We are soccer moms. We are military wives. We are vets. You name it, we have it on our team. 
We are from all different walks and stages of life. We have women who have gone through divorce. We have single moms. We have women who have gone through abusive situations. We have recovering addicts. We have women all across the board on our team. But at the core, we are the same. We are women who want more. We are women, we are women who want to give to give, not to receive. We are women who want to share our story of health and hope and opportunity. We are women that want to drastically change our lives, but then change the lives of others. So whether or not you're someone that simply wants more, maybe you're looking for more like I was. Maybe you have a loss of identity. Maybe you just need more passion and purpose and hope. Coaching will do that for you. Maybe you need more accountability with your health and fitness and you need someone to help you stay strong on the inside out. Coaching will do that for you. Maybe you simply love health and fitness. Maybe you're a fitness fanatic like me and you're a registered nurse, you're a personal trainer, uh, you're in the healthcare profession and maybe you just want to help more people than you already are. Coaching can do that for you. Our coach sisterhood We'll accept you for you, flaws and all. We will help you stay healthy truly from the inside out in every area. And we will help you live that passion, that life of passion, purpose, and freedom that you were called to live. I know it because I've experienced it in my own life. I am now a stay-at-home mama. I am a girl boss. I am a mom boss. I'm an entrepreneur woman. And I stayed home with my three kids. My husband travels literally every week for work and I get to stay home with my kids. I get to work part-time, I get to work, make my own hours, I get to be my own boss, and I get to help others do the same exact thing. I used to work in the hospital as a registered nurse, not making a lot of money as a registered nurse. I now make quadruple what I make as a registered nurse, over six figures, and I get to wake up excited about life. I get to live my passion. Do you? Do you get to live your passion? Because I get to live my passion out loud every single day for health and fitness, for sisterhood, for community, for freedom, and it's because of coaching. It's because I said yes to coaching. And I would love to welcome you onto our amazing and perfectly balanced team. I would love to talk to you phone, chat, Zoom chat, email, whatever it is, I would love to hear about your story. And I would love to hear about why you're interested in coaching so that you can see that you would be a remarkable coach, that you have a story to share with others and that you can be a life changer too. So I cannot wait to welcome some amazing new ladies onto our Imperfectly Balanced team. And I cannot wait to help you transform your life from the inside out, but then be able to share that with others. So thank you for watching to this video. I cannot wait to connect with you and just thank you from the bottom of my heart and I cannot wait to see how your life can be forever, ever transformed because of coaching. Bye.